Before I start the video, lads, if you want coin, check out the full shop. 100% reliable link is in the description. What's up, guys? Boyle96 HD here. I am back with another player review for you today. Today, we're going to be reviewing Sonia Luco, the whole city striker. He's in my BPL Silver team, which I'll run through in a few minutes. But he plays for Hull City, as I said. He's Nigerian, he's 71 rated, and a fantastic, fantastic player. A few of his on card stats that stand out his 89 pace, 70 shooting, and 80 dribbling are the highlight of his stats. He's left footed, which is nice actually because long is right footed. I have a marksman card applied to him. As you can see, he's got me 17 goals in 20 games with 7 assists, so I think that's really nice in my opinion. High medium work rates. Bit small being 5 foot 8, but I'm feeling it adds to his pace or his nimble footwork in general. But we'll get on to that a bit further more in the video. But as you can see, the team there Long, Zaha, Loudon, Akore, Medel, Lori, Wanyama, Butner, Tonev, and in goals you have Kieran Westwood. But onto his in game stats, the few ones that stand out to me, as you can see, his high ball control there, his finishing is decent, definitely. Dribbling, I have a marksman card I apply to him, so I'm nearly sure, I'm 90% sure that that affects your in game stats. So let me know in the comments for uh, if you are 100% sure. I don't want to call out that in case I'm not right, but I am nearly sure that that does affect it. But onto his physical attributes, that's the main one that stand out. As you can see, his 92 acceleration. His strength, not the highest stat, but it doesn't really affect him in game because he has the pace to uh, break any defence. I feel after the patch, it's also helped him. It feels a lot more like FIFA 13 to me, and Luko just has the pace to absolutely break any defence. But anyway, onto his main in-game stats, as you've seen there. The main ones that just stand out have to be his ball control, his finishing, acceleration, sprint speed, and uh, they're just the main ones off the top of my head because they're all high 80s. But uh, Aluko, as you can see, he's kind of involved in every goal, and I think you'll see that from the clips. If not scoring the goals, he has a pace to break the defence and set up a goal. He has the finishing ability, as you can see there, a lovely, or a lovely chip on goal. If you ask me for a negative on this guy... It's hard to pick one because he does everything for how cheap he is. And I'm very surprised how cheap he is. Everybody was on about silver investments at the start of the game. And this guy was about thirty or 40,000 coins. And ever since that, silver prices have just plummeted down. So I do expect him to go back up to 20 or 30k. It's more of a matter of when because player prices are a bit dodgy this year. But we'll see. But if you're wondering, would you buy this guy? 100% lads. He's going to get you goals from anywhere on the pitch. He has the skills. He's only 3 star skills, but he has the skills in general to beat defences, step overs and whatnot. 3 star skills, as most of you will know, is a lot of bollocks. He should have 4 or 5. But what can you do? He's left footed, which is not too bad at all. His finishing ability is fantastic. He can score penalties, he can score free kicks. And he's almost involved in 99%. Or he is involved in 99% of the goals. And um, finesse shots, shots from outside the box. You'll see from the next couple of clips also... His true fucking pace, 89 pace and 80 dribbling, it's just absolutely fantastic. The pace is just absolutely demolished defences in a heartbeat, and then the dribbling ability to literally walk by them. Makes for a fantastic, fantastic player with a deadly left foot, the ability to strike it from anywhere, and to really test the keeper, as you'll see. Here's an example of his pace. Breaks two defenders, no chance of catching him, using his good 80 dribbling here, just to waltz in and out through defenders, and a lovely finish into the bottom left-hand corner. So I 100% recommend him. As I said, for me, he's a 9 or 10, 9 out of 10 even. And I can't pick a really down, downfall in his game. Really, everything he does, he'll score your goals. He'll score your goals from anywhere. He makes great attacking moves. And his finishing is very good for a silver card. So lads, this has been an inf or not an inform. I wish it wasn't an inform. But it has been a Sonia Luka review. 71 rated, Hull City striker for the Premier League. Has to win your BPL silver team, in my opinion. If you don't have them, try them out and leave in the comments how you use them and if you do rate them. But thank you very much for watching, lads. If you have enjoyed this video, please leave it a like. I'd really appreciate that. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Have a fantastic day as always. And uh, yeah, bye bye.